do another example question regarding towards half life and integrity rate law. Okay, so now let's look at this particular question. Okay, so this question itself is saying carbon fourteen has half life of five thousand seven hundred twenty years. Okay, so let's put that down. Okay, so we know the given info will be half life will equals to that many years. Okay. And then saying this is first order reaction. This is not just there, right? It tells us important information. First order, okay? First order now for half life will equals to what? 0.693 divided by k. K represents what? The rate constant. Okay, so that's the inf important information we know because it's first order, right? Okay, so we we'll combine, we can um, now connect this to information. Okay, and then the second half of this question, if you read it, says if a piece of wood has converted, has converted 75% of this carbon 14, then how old is it? Okay, so has converted means there will be. Yes, 25% left, right? So has converted 75, then whatever left at this moment, which is going to tell us how old this piece of wood will be, that's 25% left, okay? So therefore, we know the concentration at this moment, right? Okay, so it will be 100% minus 75% of the initial. That's how much it will be at this moment, okay? And then you go, I know the concentration at this moment, okay? And then I know, um, no, I don't know much, okay? And then I'm looking for what? I'm looking for how old, so the T, okay? So that's what we're looking for. Okay? And then you go, concentration, sort of, I could, we, I could calculate this K, okay, rate constant, and then I have K constant, concentration and then time okay integral rate law sounds like could help me to solve this okay and then since this is a first order reaction first order reaction okay so then i can go to the equation okay so the equation is of nitro log of the concentration final concentration over initial initial concentration equals to negative kt okay and then again, we could calculate k first and then put into this expression. Okay, so let's actually do that quickly. Okay, so because we know these two information, okay, so let me just bring these two, then we can use them to do the calculation. Okay, so we have these two, and then which means, okay, so which means t will go to five, uh, five um, thousand. 720 years will equals to 0.693 divided by k, right? k will just equals to 0.693 divided by 5,720 years, okay? If you want to bring the units. So after you do this calculation, I get 0 0.000121 years to negative 1 as unit, okay? So that's our k, okay, rate constant, okay? And then we can put that now into this equation right okay we're looking for t and then you need to deal with this part okay so that part is not bad because we had this relationship figured out from reading the question okay so therefore i could do i could do okay so i can go okay natural log okay since one more time right since that a the concentration at this moment equals to this so i'm gonna do it so after you calculate that's 25%, right? 25% of con initial concentration divided by initial concentration, which means that it cancel out, right? Okay. Then it goes to negative 0 0.000121. I'll do years negative 1 times t. t is time. That's something we're looking for. Okay, so on the left side, you get natural log of 25% equals to negative point zero 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 one two one so like times t okay natural log of twenty five you put into your calculator you should get about the value around negative one point three nine and then you have negative point 
and just copy this thing. Okay, so we have this, and t will just equal to 1.39 divided by 0 0.000121 years negative 1. So when you flip the units up, back up, that'll be years. So that's perfect. Okay, so I'm just going to do it. So you have negative like 0 0.000121 years negative 1. Remember, when you have negative 1 over to the power negative 1, that gives you positive 1. Okay, so then the t at the end is equals to about it's not exact but about the first answer so that's how many years of this piece of wood will be this uh, carbon 14 okay so as i said as a hint all right as a hint okay so the hint will be right for this question itself since it's first order because of this remember it will take the same amount of time to get to the first half-life also will be the same long time to get the second half-life. As a hint, please think about it if there's any other way to solve this question. Okay, And then um, that's the end of this video and thank you for listening.